Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Fahmi bin Abdul Razak. I am lecturer in Polytechnic Melaka with 15 years experience in civil engineering field. Since the early 2001, when I was posting in this Polytechnic, the characteristic of TVET is gradually changed and posed more challenges to upgrade the level of teaching in here. of TVET is concerned with the acquisition of knowledge, skills, and attitude for the world of work. So, to ensure that TVET is really contribute in industry, it must start from the student itself. I mean, yeah, attitude. To make TVET teaching is more effective, the educators must guide and give more attention as students in the classroom. The environment in the class will reflect the educator's way of teaching and this will attract student interest in study. The purpose of TVET, especially in civil engineering in 21st century, provide the right skill to the student and the young people in fulfilling their dreams. With the skill that provide, so the student will achieve their ambition to go further in civil engineering. Civil engineers have an important role in today's society. They are people behind the scenes of construction job which result in important building and structure. Should problem lies, they are the ones who step up to take control and come up with a possible solution. Tibet also can guide them through their career decision, the career that they can pursue like engineer, surveyor, contractor, and draftman, and so on. To that point, the Polytechnic will try our best to fulfill their ambition of our student by offering the relevant course based on theory and practical. Learn the theory in class is not sufficient for an individual to be able to become competent or proficiency in the hand-on skill. So the skill should be developed in laboratory or site after they learn about the theory in the class. they will experience the real situation of work. During the process and the end, the civil engineer must have superior analytical skills and possess excellent problem-solving capabilities, such as design and structural analysis costs, because that needs students to enhance their, their critical thinking skills. Technical and vocational education 
and training in Malaysia is changing in terms of structure, program, process, and practice in order to be effective in improving the quality outcomes, making it more accessibility and attractive to all, and ensuring it is relevant and connected to the world of work. The theoretical learning is not enough for students in class, so the practical with new technology should be exposed in lab, like using total station and using SDR and mapping software like students here. Yeah. Industry-based training will be given to graduates in the term of increasing knowledge, experience, and entrepreneurial skills to enable graduates carry out projects and studies. Education and competition are two universal ingredients of all human culture. Humans have always considered education and computation important issues, both in the past and in the present. By participating in various competitions such as Bridge, Bull and Break at UTM, Concrete Pontoon Competition at UTHM, and the Concrete Frisbee Competition in UTP help students to be elicited ability to practice the theory and skill that they already learn in class. This is proven by some of their success in this competition. After ensuring they are conquer the theoretical method, then we will give students tasks like assignment, group discussion, and some project according to the syllabus. With application of our technology nowadays, educators can mix their pedagogy styles of teaching. For example, in Polytechnic, we have a CDOS as a platform to apply blended learning, which is a combination of e-learning and pedagogy. So, what are your opinion about TVET? For us, TVET is a channel to prepare students facing a real working environment. There is no longer a problem of culture shock, but students will be feeling deja vu. This is because the students seem to have been the real situation in the workplace when they study in polytechnic. Nowadays, most jobs in the world require technical and vocational skills and civil engineering still needed in our industries. Therefore, TVET is a part of tertiary education and training which provide accredited training in job related and technical skills. That's all from us. Thank you. Assalamualaikum.